we have the opportunity to make a habit of empathy. We agreed that empathy, or what's in a person's heart, to borrow a phrase from then Senator Obama, should not influence the decisions of a judge. I think we were all a little surprised when Judge Sotomayor at the hearing rejected President Obama's standard. She said, I wouldn't approach the issue of judging the way the president does. Judges can't rely on what's in their heart, she said. They don't determine the law. Congress makes the law. The job of a judge is to apply the law, and so it's not the heart that compels conclusions in cases. It's the law. Now, I agree with that statement, and indeed, Republicans and Democrats alike appear to embrace that statement of an appropriate judicial philosophy. No one defended the statement that then-Senator Obama made with regard to empathy or what is in a person's heart, and I was encouraged to see that. Now, Mr. President, supporters of Judge Sotomayor appear willing to accept her statements that I've just quoted at the Judiciary Committee at face value. And I hope they're right. I really do. I certainly intend to take my colleagues' agreement with these statements at face value. And uh, I expect that future nominees to the federal judiciary that will conform to this new consensus articulated by Judge Sotomayor at her hearing and embraced in a bipartisan fashion by the members of the Judiciary Committee.